how a motherboard works. The motherboard can be compared to the nervous system. Nearly every component relies on the motherboard and is connected to it in some way. It is essentially a circuit board with paths or traces that transmit power and relay commands to the other components to tell them what action is needed. For each action, an electronic impulse is sent to the motherboard. The board determines what the impulse is, what is needed, and which component must be implemented to complete the function. For instance, when you hit the A on the keyboard, an impulse is sent to the motherboard. The motherboard sends the impulse to the video card or onboard video system. The video card determines that the letter A is needed when sends that information back through the motherboard. The board then determines where the information gets from there in case the monitor where the A seems to appear instantly even though many processes have occurred in order to get there. Another example is when you click an icon to an open program. Again, an impulse is sent to the motherboard. The motherboard then signals the hard drive to load the information into RAM. The motherboard then sends a command to the video card so it can calculate what needs to be drawn, like text, colors, images, and the video card sends that information back of the motherboard, which sends it to the monitor. All of these things take place so quickly that the information goes from a click of the mouse to an image on your monitor in mere nanoseconds. As you can see, the motherboard is one of the most important parts of your system. Make sure it is compatible with your other components and make sure it is a good stable board.